Furion versus Rexar. Let the hunt begin. I must protect. All right, Hunter. I go first, so those cards are pretty useless. Yeah, White Grove is always a really good card to have. Usually, I'm fishing for White Grove and Innovates. When I go second, I might keep Keeper because I can play him in turn three. You can compare it with keeping a Harvest Golem, for example. When you would go first, it's like a free drop. I haven't faced a hunter in a long time, so I have no idea what he's playing. It might be like the Lebanon one, but it's actually a bad opener when you go second. Um, yeah, it's much stronger if he plays, le let's say, the Lebanon in turn one when he goes first than when he has the coin. Oh yeah, I expected to see something different. So, where's my keeper now? This card is obviously really strong. Uh, I have already the combo in my hand, that's pretty unlucky. Oh yeah, nice top deck right there. Perfect. I must safeguard the What if that's a snipe, snipe? Yeah, I knew it. Snipe. At least he doesn't get a weapon stack. Okay, that's an easy swap. I could use the the ref, but I don't want to take four damage if I don't have uh, absolutely have to. So basically, I'm just stalling till I can play the lore. If he rushes me, the light protects me. Okay, he's a rush tag, so I might consider using the law for healing. That's interesting. I can develop the keeper. I'm not sure yet what kind of deck he plays, that's a problem. But usually it's better to develop a minion on the board. I must safeguard the light. Than just uh just, just attacking it and cycling. Now I have the minion I can uh, work with. Okay, that is, this is really good. Now I can use one lore for drawing cards and one lore for here. I don't want to drop too low. The light protects me. I have to proc the, but not yet. Huh? I'm not. I'm pretty sure it's not a freezing trap. Could be a freezing trap though, but you don't want to freeze a keep of the grove. Hmm. I could just heal myself. I don't want to give him weapon stacks, uh, charges. I mean, I could kill him in one turn. Hmm. I'll do that. Feel nature's wrath. So I see if it's actually a. Uh... No. I'm wait for no one. If my both lords stay on board. I have lethal. It's 14. 14 damage plus 14. 28. Actually, I have to hit him. Well, if it's not a freezing trap, I have lethal. If it's a freezing trap, I will be missing one damage. Two. Yeah, one damage. So he has a second weapon. Right? Okay. So giving him ta uh, stacks doesn't really effect because he will be able to attack me every turn anyways Feel nature's so let's wrath. see what kind of trap this is it's a freezing trap that's fine it's really important that i can actually attack him this turn so 
so next turn I have leave. So I just go ahead and kill myself. There's no card I need right now, just to be safe. So if he doesn't clear my board, he will lose next turn. Except he plays a misdirection, freezing traps. I mean, he wouldn't just play an explosive trap. So he will play a trap. Just expect him to play... Um, but actually I can just test what kind of trap it is. Oh. That's a weird version of Hunter. I like it. Like so, two such different uh, new decks are playing. Yeah. I guess my bouncy deck was a little bit stronger. 